Okay, so in today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a Python program executable. So basically, you launch whatever IDE you have and you make your program. And when you open it up, you want to put this line in the top. Pound exclamation point backslash user backslash bin backslash env and then whatever Python environment you're using. In this case, it's Python 3. That's all you have to do with the actual Python program that you created. And then what I'm doing here is I have a folder that's relatively hidden and I have the files that I need to make the program. I have the Python file a picture that is contained within the Python program. This will be the desktop launcher image and this is the program I use to create the desktop image. So the first step is to navigate to the folder that the Python executable file is stored in. And you can do that by copying this up here. And you go into your terminal and you type cd space and you paste this in. Of course, this put the name of the executable file. Or actually it didn't. This just did the location which is good so when you hit enter now you're in the folder that the executable file is located in so step two is to tell your operating software that this is an executable file and you do that by typing chmod plus x and then you want to put the python file name so you right click it and hit rename and then just highlight it and copy and you paste this in the terminal, hit enter, and this file has now been designated as executable. And you can test that by typing dot uh, backslash, rather, no space, and then paste the name of the program. And when you hit enter, this is the executable program that I made, the compounding interest rate calculator. So this program is now executable, but how do you make a desktop launcher for it. Well, that's what we're going to do now. You need a plain text editor, something like Sublime Text. I'm going to save a file. I'm going to name it, um, you know, name it whatever, but the extension has to be desktop. That's right, that's what the extension is going to be, is desk desktop. All right, so now we have our desktop file where did it go launcher desktop right here and now we're going to put some code in here we're gonna do brackets desktop entry do a new line version equals 1.0 new line name this will be the name of the um, the program. So um, need to do compounding interest calculator. Go to a new line, and now you're going to designate what file is executable. So what file this points to? So exec, and you're going to go to the file path, the exact file path. So copy this file path again and paste it in here. And this also contains the uh, name of the file that I need, which is compound against interest, interest rate calculate. That's the name of the Python file that I'm going to execute. You'll have to make sure you append this at the end of the file path, which it already is. So then you make a new line and then you have your icon. So the icon is going to be the file path for this. This is the icon. So I'm actually just going to paste this in again and I'm going to get rid of the compounding interest rate Python app. And I will right click on the picture of the launcher and click rename and I will just copy the name of that picture and I will paste that at the end of file. So then you hit enter and type equals application. And now if you save this, you'll notice on my screen this turned into 
the little launcher icon that I have. And if I double click this, if everything went well, it says untrusted launcher. I'm going to just launch it or mark as executable actually is what I will do. And here it is. Here's the program. Let's X out of it. Let's X out of this too to get it out of the way. Double click that. And there it is. So basically I just created a launcher for this Python program. It is right there. I can put it in the dock. Here it go. There it goes. I can put it in the dock if I want to. Of course, uh, when I put it in the dock, it's not going to show the picture for some reason. I'm not quite sure why that is. It did it on my other Linux computer. Let's try again. Yep, I don't know. It doesn't want to show the picture in the dock. But the picture is on the desktop. Double click. And there's the program. And just keep these files right here. Because if you move any of these files and you have to re-specify the path of any of the image files in this uh, launcher, for example, or you, if you move the program file, you'll need to re-specify the path on the terminal because you're telling the computer that this file of this path is executable. So if you move it to a different path, then you need to redefine that in the terminal and tell the computer that's executable. But that is it to make a Python program executable with a desktop icon in Linux. I don't quite know how to do it in Mac or Windows, but that's how you do it in Linux. Thank you for watching.